Taking a look now at some news from across Virginia, it appears that the fight over skill games being located in convenience stores and other businesses is over. Well, at least for the time being anyway. On Monday, November the 13th, the judge dismissed a lawsuit challenging the state's ban on skill games. According to WDBJ News, Judge Lewis Lerner granted the state's motion for summary judgment during a hearing that was held in Greensville County Circuit Court. In making his ruling, Judge Lerner said the Supreme Court had ruled to the satisfaction of the court and to proceed to trial would be inappropriate. Former NASCAR driver and truck stop owner Hermie Sadler brought the lawsuit over two years ago. On Monday, owners of convenience stores and other small businesses that host the machines came from across the Commonwealth in a show of support. State Senator Bill Stanley told the crowd that had gathered outside of the courthouse in Emporia that it isn't gambling, that they are skill games. He told the crowd that they are not criminals, but the backbone of Virginia. Stanley and Sadler's other attorneys maintain that playing a skill game is not the same as gambling, and the state's ban, they argued, is unconstitutional. But an attorney representing the state said Virginia isn't outlawing the machines, it's prohibiting the conduct of wagering on the outcome of a game. Judge Lerner had issued a temporary injunction, injunction allowing the machines to continue operating while the case was pending, but in October, a three-judge panel of the Supreme Court overturned that injunction. During Monday's hearing, Judge Lerner cited the Supreme Court decision as he granted the state's motion for a summary judgment. Skill game supporters say that they were disappointed with the ruling, but they are determined to fight on. We've included a link to the story. It's on our Star News TV Facebook page at facebook.com slash Star News TV.